you now. Just fuck. Just don't even put in multiplayer. Seriously. Just fuck it. You guys. After Modern Warfare 3, I was done. Oh, I have an idea. Yes. Look at this guy. Ah. All he wanted was a girlfriend, man. Can you blame him? What was this? Foreman Bob, right? I knew it. <laughs> I knew it. It was Foreman Bob. I knew it. Now this this stage is a pretty good song. It shares it with uh, another one. Do 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 do. Uh 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 uh. All right, now this this puzzle puzzles like this used to give me so much trouble. Okay, until watch until this. All right. The first puzzle is to turn all these blocks yellow. If you have trouble, come back and talk to me. All right. The first puzzle is to turn all the yellow, all the blocks yellow. Ready? This shit used to be so hard. Watch this. One, two, three, four. Easy. Wow. I figured it out one day. I'm like, I was an idiot as a kid. Alright. Now somehow he gets there before I do. Alright, I think that's all the all the treasure in there, yep. It's all the treasure in the water. Alright, we gotta help this poor guy. Flame the idol. The tiki head. Actually no, th this isn't um this this isn't the game that has the tikis. This idol says he's hungry and won't be satisfied until he swallowed ten fish. He's got a sensitive stomach, so watch what kind of fish you feed him. Alright, now this is really, really more about patience than anything. You gotta feed him any kind of yellow fish. Here's the thing though, sometimes they don't spawn any yellow fish. So you end up sitting here for like five minutes, no yellow fish spawn. It's more boring than real life fishing. Oh? Oh? Fish look cute though. I don't know why they keep jumping up as though, you know, I'm gonna feed them to this gigantic rock idol. What a great fate. Like, look, come on! Where's the yellows? Thank you. Like, you'll be fucking sitting here forever. You want to feed me a yellow? What's that in the background? I think that's a scarab. It's like, come on! There's not, not a single goddamn yellow. Like, one out of every 20 fish is a yellow. Oh, shit. I wasn't expecting that, so I had my finger off circle. Come on! Three more! Can you please just give me a yellow? Thank you. Two more. Oh shit! You see that though, right? They tried to make me flame two at once. Done. Okay, Spider Man, 
Pyro, just one more puzzle to go. I'll meet you over by the college stones for your final challenge. All right, well, I haven't gone over there yet. All right, so let's get moving. We gotta now actually play the rest of the level. All right, these guys are using metal shields. You have to charge them. He's roasting his weenie. Those metal What's happening? shields are making enemies invulnerable to your flame attack. If you press and hold the square button, you can defeat them with your charge attack. No, I wouldn't want to be holding a piece of hot metal. Just saying. That's just me, though. It's not my specialty, holding extremely hot metal. It's gonna hit me with a shish kebab. Actually, that makes me more hungry than uh, scared of him. Standing on a gem. <laughs> Say up. It is true. It is up. All right, there you go. All right, now this guy has the final bit, uh, the final puzzle. Stones in the correct order, you will solve the puzzle. I only know what the first one is. It's up to you to figure the rest out. All right, it's easy. All right, wait for the camera angle to change. All right, so the first one is a star, right? So jump on the next star. Jump on the hexagonal thing, right? Now you gotta jump on this, right? Because it's orange. Then you gotta jump on the next moon. And then finally, this. Done. Only thing is he teleports you back here. Nice job, Damn it. You're pretty smart for a dragon. All I have to give you is this shiny thing I found in our toolbox. An orb, I'll take it. Alright, I have one eighth of all the orbs. I gotta rush back there. Because there's still a lot to be done in this level. I actually probably could complete this game all day uh all today. Probably could. You see, I would have started like three hours ago if I wasn't so stupid and well, actually it wasn't my fault. But the reason why I didn't start earlier is because my HD PVR was unplugged. So I had no clue that it was unplugged. And I'm like, oh, well, my computer isn't registering it. And I, I panicked for a second. I'm like, well, what if it's broken, you know? What if someone kicked it or what if someone, like, stepped on it or something when they really shouldn't have? When they really shouldn't be going in my room and doing stuff like that? You know, what happens then? Then I gotta buy another HD PVR, which is gonna cost me money. That I really can't afford to sacrifice right now. I'm buying like a thousand dollars now, like sixteen hundred dollars worth of stuff over these next couple of months, man. I gotta save up. I'm only getting fifteen hundred this summer. I gotta scrap up money anyway. I have to scrap up sixty-two. All right, I hate this one because sometimes I misjudge what I have to do. There you go, did it. Make it rain. These hoes make it rain. Boom. Look at that. The hula girl's rain dance blew up that idol like a 
Roman candle. Now I can pursue that dancing career I've dreamed of. Take this orb. It could help you go places. Actually, it will. Oh, there's only two in this? Oh, yeah, there's only two. Expected more. Alright, let's go grab these gems. That's what I'm saying, man. This one has a catchy uh, level music. It really does. I know I did a playthrough of Spyro 1. I didn't make it 100% because at that time I didn't underst I didn't know how to 100% some levels. You know, now that was what 2010, 2011. Like when did I do that playthrough? Like ages ago. I think that was 2010. I actually planned to do these games like within close repetition to each other. That didn't happen though. shit. I was actually gonna, like, play all the Spyro games really quickly. That didn't happen. And, uh, at least I think I was. I'm gonna redo that playthrough eventually. Keyword there, though, is eventually. Right? It's inside that, right? Okay, I'll, I'll get that. Uh, uh, uh. That might actually be a cheat code, because I know he doesn't do it normally until the end of the game. Alright, now I gotta go the other way. And when he does do it at the end of the game, that's all he does. So you see this? It's hard to see sometimes what your health is, because Sparks is always doing that. I don't think he had a speaking role yet, though. I think that came later. Done. All I gotta do is get the talisman. All right, Foreman Max. All right. Was it a hammer? Nah, it's an idle head. Damn it. I didn't remember it. Oh, done. I didn't get to hear the damn trumpy, uh, trumpet music. That sucks. Oh, shit. We missed one. Oh. Oh, no. No. <laughs> I want to roast my weenie. Oh, okay. Sure. Why not? I want to scorch my sausage. All right, I think that's it for right now, right? I gotta swim down here. Did I grab any gems down here? No, I did not. I think that's it. I gotta actually go into the castle where there's two more levels. One of which you actually can't complete this or one of the levels until you've gone to the next place. Boink. 